All right, I've got a little pro tip for you guys on forge welding sand mine or laminate billets or just even uh, your typical Damascus billet for that matter. This one's forge welded and I just pulled it out of the forge, just ran it through the power hammer for the last pass. And I'm setting it on the anvil here or any large block of steel or something that's gonna pull heat out of it. What you're looking for is this to cool down as one unit, as a single block, because that's what it is if in fact it is properly forge welded. If it's not forge welded, even if the layers are stuck really close together, but if it's not forge welded, it's not going to cool down as a single unit like this. You will be able to see most of the time a demarcation or a delineation between the layers if they're not actually forge welded because they're still separate pieces. But you can see here, this is cooling down. It's cooler right here on the ends than it is in the middle. And that's normal, that's fine. Any block of steel would do that. But what you do not see is a difference between this side and this side in the cooling. And you don't see any difference on the edges either. You can see this whole thing is cooling down more on the outer edges, of course, but evenly so. It looks like a solid piece of steel, because that's what it is.